All right, so the stable may take a little bit of work, but I really hope we can leave some of the gorgeous greenery that has grown on it. And I have to admit, I love how they have this little bridge that actually has the road going through it. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh, we have one of Melody Warrior's siblings right over there. The paddock should be easy enough to fix if you could call moving a ton of rocks easy. And then, let's see, fixing up this care station. Ugh, we're gonna need a real mason for that. I have no idea how to help out with that. But uh, everything, well, at least is here. We've got some of the basic layouts to help out with fixing the South Hoof Rescue Ranch. So welcome back everyone! Autumn Promise and I have been very excited to show up here on South Hoof Peninsula because there is a new face and apparently two spirits staring down one another side to side. This is amazing! Oh my gosh, this is kind of amazing. Look at all of that. There's two spirits, so many of them, all wrapped up together. I guess that shows that uh, there's a lot of wild horses and a lot of wild horse spirits going on here, right? But anyway, we are here helping Hugh get ready to fix up this entire area as a glorious, beautiful rescue ranch where hopefully both horses and humans will be able to find a place to heal. And I can't think of a better thing to really throw ourselves behind or a better fit for Autumn Promise's gentle nature to really get a chance to grow here. So let's go ahead and we're going to wiggle in and talk to Hugh. Do you remember the task board I showed you during the tour over by the supply shed? I started a list of the most urgent jobs. There's no reason we couldn't start on them right away. All right, so examine the task board by the storage shed and see what jobs need doing. On it, how to build a ranch. So he set up a nice task board, very organized. I highly approve. Everybody is really, really happy. <laughs> I'm so excited to see a big group of people meeting with one another like that. All right, and let's see what tasks we need to do in order to help out with this rescue ranch. This is the Rescue Ranch Task Board. Here you will see all the tasks available for rebuilding and restoring the ranch. You will need to complete all the tasks here before the story can progress. All right, got it. So, grooming station, care station, water, um, uh, let's go with the grooming station. Begin repairs at the grooming station. Got it. Can I just check all of them? Hey, that's pretty nifty. All right, well, uh, does it tell me... Begin repairs of the washing station. Remove rubbish from the paddock. All right, well, looks like we're just gonna have to go ahead and get started. Autumn Promise, you may wanna stand clear so I don't accidentally whack at you with the hammer. And keep an eye on your little kitten, okay? All right, so what? Okay, I've picked up a few skills. <laughs> I have picked up just a few skills, apparently, since we have um, been helping out all over Jorvik. What the heck? I just got in there like nobody's business. Wow. I guess this is what happens when, you know, I've spent the last two and a half years helping out all over the island. I have become a barn raising expert. Oh my gosh. This is going to go a lot faster than I thought it was. Check that out! So now we have got the feeding station done. That's fantastic, and that didn't take any time at all. Whoa, and look at how detailed it is. Okay, yes, yeah, somebody needs to like hire me for all of these things because this is fantastic. Look at the little apple and carrots. We have got some bandages and a cute little puppy. Hi, buddy, that we can hang out with here. All right, hang on a second, Autumn Promise. I'm gonna run over to the paddock just because it's right over here. Ugh, moving those rocks is gonna take a hot minute, I think, but we're gonna need to fix the gate so I can get in there first. All right, gate, 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 how do I fix you? There we go. This should be pretty straightforward. Nice. All right, now that that's done, lots and lots of heavy boulders to get out of the way. Man, this goes fast. Yeah, I thought it would take me so much longer, but again, I really do need to give myself credit. We have done so many things around the island and through the course of the stories that just removing a bunch of heavy boulders must feel like a walk in the park. So let's take care of these. And once that's done, we have repairs for the grooming station, repairs for the washing station, 
What a fun way. I really love this new updated way that they have set up the chores too. And I think that that's going to be something moving forward if they haven't already implemented it in the other areas. I remember reading that it is actually going to be a new way of assigning and showing off the chores that you can do that will be hopefully spreading to a lot of the other places. But look at the paddock. We could come and definitely stretch some legs here. This is fantastic. And the seagull is still just chilling. I love the seagulls, they're so cute. When we went to Iceland, there were so many seagulls and shorebirds, but what I was really after was the puffins, and those were really exciting to see. Fun fact, the puffins were entirely quiet. The seagulls cawed, the other shorebirds made all sorts of squawking noise, but the puffins were so eerily silent that even though I was staring at a cliffside with hundreds of them, they didn't make a single sound. It was just the seagulls in the distance that you could hear. Very interesting. So maybe that seagull isn't too noisy and is not going to attack you for whatever food you have to offer. All right, two more spots over here. Let's slow down a little bit. Anna Promise, do you want to wait over here by the well? And she's getting a little experience from this too. I really can't think of a better place for her to be able... Okay, that was really funny on Miss Birchweb there. But I can't think of a better place for her to be able to relax. All right, let's get this taken care of. Nice. So I think this is the grooming station. Or the washing station. That took literally no time at all. I feel so immensely competent right now. <laughs> wow, does that mean we'll get some of the rescue horses here soon? Alright, let's get this taken care of. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I think somebody's a little bit stuck. There we go. And finally, the washing station. Yeah, we kind of have got this in the bag. Nice. That really didn't take any time at all. All right, well. Autumn Promise. Oh wow, I gave her a snuggle. I didn't even mean to, but I did, and that just made my heart so happy. Oh wow. Okay. Autumn Promise is so happy here. We have got apples all over the place. We have set up all of the various spots, but I'm sure there's more to do. I mean, there's a lot of debris, and that took care of a whole bunch of the outbuildings, but definitely not the main stable. How can I help now, Hugh? We're making good progress. To be honest, I thought it would take a lot longer to get the rescue ranch up and running. But thanks to the hard work of you and the other volunteers, who I'm going to imagine there were like a ton of them. I mean, clearly there are a ton of them running around and all of our combined experience raised those uh, buildings really quickly. We're halfway there. Check out the task board for a list of what's next. All right, on it. Also, Hugh, I highly approve of how organized you are by setting up this task board. All right, so we probably need to get rid of a bunch of this debris next, would be my guess. Let's see. And more experience for Autumn Promise. Ranch Gate 1, begin repairs on the main gate. Home Stable 1, Stage 1, begin repairs on the home stable. Clean up the debris on the ranch, the branches on the ranch, clear away the overgrowth on the ranch, and mend the broken fences around the ranch. Oh, that's going to keep us really busy, but that's the kind of important work that needs done. All right, Autumn Promise, I'm not sure if you can help me, but let's see. All right, how about this? Whoa, easy there, girl. <clears throat> oh, I need to be dismounted first, but it actually helps you dismount. That is so cool. Much, much easier than having to, like, s like stop everything. Oh, I swear. Yeah, I, I mention it, like, every single time that we adventure in Jorvik, but guys, I just feel like Star Stable is getting better and better and better, and they're really digging their heels in, really trying to make it so that the world becomes more interactive and alive, really trying to make it like I, the pet, in fact, I want to go give her another pet, <laughs> really trying to make it so that when you pet and interact with your horses, I mean, the saddle pets, look at Anna Promise, Anna Promise, hey, hey, I don't want to lead you, I want to give you another pet. Are you too busy? <laughs> no, she's too busy eating the grass. Okay, here. If you were enjoying it, I'm gonna leave you here. It'd be kind of cool if you saw them grazing only where there's like grass. And if I stood her out in the cobblestones, if she just looked bored, that would be like a fun little detail. But we'll think more about that later. All right, prickly overgrowth. That always reminds me of GED for some reason. Let's go ahead. We can plant something prettier there in the future. I love cleaning up and taking care of ranches and places like this. It just makes my heart sore. There we go. 
Let's get this tidied up. That's one of the reasons that I love Stardew Valley. I love all the harvest moons. Whenever I get frustrated in life, I'll sometimes pretend that my life is like a harvest moon ranch that I just inherited. I need to clean it up. I need to tidy it up. And I'll pretend my problems are like big boulders and I need to think, ah, oh, do I have the hammer strong enough to get rid of this boulder? And if I don't, how can I get it? And I know that sounds really silly, but seriously, that was a big way of how I helped to change my life when I was younger. Especially when I was transitioning out of high school and into college and I didn't really know what to do with myself. If I felt really frustrated, I would just think, oh, okay. So these problems are like the weeds and the tree trunks and the boulders on a ranch in Harvest Moon. How can I get rid of them? And then how can I plant seeds so that things will become even better in my life? And if I'm patient, I can get a better harvest. So again, sounds silly, but it seriously did change my life. So whenever you're looking at all of this debris, maybe think if you're feeling frustrated lately or like you want to do something grand and big like this, but you feel like you just can't, think about what are the, the big pieces of debris that need picked up and how can you actually get them out of your life? Because once you remove them, you'll have the space open to plant something new. So there's my serious message of the day, but I mean it. I really, really, really changed my life because of those thoughts. So I'll pass them on to you guys. All right, let's go ahead and clean up this debris. We've almost cleaned up. Yay, all right, I think we have cleaned up all of the debris. Now we just need to clean up uh, one more overgrowth, two more branches, and then we can get to work on the stables and the fences. All right, Anna Promise, I think I'm gonna need your help now. She still is nibbling that grass. She seems very happy with what she's doing. All right, come on, girl. I need to find just a few more places. The overgrowth is right over here. And then we'll run over to, there we go. Man, somebody is glitched out over there too. <laughs> That's kind of amazing to see. Woo, yeah. It's like they're walking their horse with a drone. <laughs> All right, so where is the last branch? I really wanna make sure that I get all of one thing before I start moving into another. Is it gonna be hiding behind here? All right, there's some fencing that does need repaired up there as well. Nothing behind the stables. Oof. You know, I guess if we don't take care of this fencing, who knows, maybe the wild horses could pop over and nibble all of our feed. And as happy as I am to feed the wild horses, that may may cause some problems. All right, let's get these all tidied up. Man, this is awesome. It makes me want to be more organized in my life. All right, come on. Let's get this going. And it really makes me want to like dance to this music, if that makes sense. Like clean everything and just feel the, the fantastic, beautiful music that's playing. I love this. All right, let's get this taken care of. All right, good. All those fences are done. And having everything nice and tidy. I think that this is gonna make him feel really good. Oh, look, there's a little bit more work to do on the stable up there. Should we work on the stable now, girl? I kind of wanted to save it to the last thing because it would be like the grand finale. I do need to do a little more searching. Where is that last branch? I'm not sure. Hmm, ah, there it is. All right. On a promise, could you wait here for just a second? I'm so glad that you're the one that I brought here to the island to do all this work because it is your home. And look at the beautiful fences. I love how gorgeous they are. Mossy and green. All right, let's clean this up. There we go. Come on over. Still mossy and green, maybe? Yes, still mossy and green. All right, that makes me happy. With all the little flowers growing on them. And then we'll go up along this fence. And then we can take care of the ranch gate. So that'll be the next thing. And we'll finish up by finally repairing the actual home stable. And I wonder if we actually get to help out. Wouldn't it be amazing if we got to help out with the rescue horses here? That would be thrilling. Like we could come here, especially now that it's easier to get to this island thanks to the fantastic uh, new trailer system. I guess somebody just like upgraded the trailers. But thanks to that, we can get here quite often. Bring Autumn Promise with us. Here we go. And, all right, we're making it taller and taller. Let's do this, guys. 
Look at that. And the seagull is still there. I love it. He's just watching this whole thing. Wow. Look at the sign they made for it. Beautiful. And I missed one piece of the fence that I still need to get. All right, we've got this. Come over here, do a little bit of work. There we go. All right, we're really, we're getting this. I'm pretty happy with all of the repairs that we've been doing. So let's grab Autumn Promise. And the last thing we have to do is actually working on the home stable. Huh. And I wonder if Autumn Promise is maybe getting a good chance to visit with all of these puppies. All right, oh wow, an elf just rode by. That was kind of cool. All right, come on Autumn Promise. We're just about done with the big repairs here. And we'll come over to this side. And you wait here, girl. Let's see how the beautiful stables look. I'm actually super excited to go ahead and I kind of want a, a cool picture with the stables before we repair them because this is going to be, this is gonna be it. Can you please look at me, silly me? That's better. There we go. <laughs> look at the beautiful stables. They're never gonna look like this again. Kind of old and, and built sort of like a ruins. So that'll be fun. Can you do like a little pose or something? I wonder, can you actually make them do cute little poses? I think you can. Actually, that's a good question. It has been like so long. Can I, can I make her do that? I've actually never tried to do that because I'm usually so busy. High score, friends, quest log, inventory. Can I do like a little laugh? Speaking, feeling, feeling happy. Yeah, you can. I love it. <laughs> laughing oh my gosh i've actually never used these before oh no i was really hoping so i guess you can't take a picture can you really not take a picture no okay so you cannot take a picture when you are trying to uh also use nemote that's a pity i was really hoping that that would work but that's okay Okay, that was just fun, just to get, just to know that I could do it. All right, where did the repairs for the stable go? Did I already, I could have sworn. I mean, this place needs cleaned up. Uh, begin repairs on the home stable. I think I saw something up on the top. So let's go take care of that really quickly. Wow, look at how cute. Here we go. Cleaning up the mess. Is that everything? Stage two. So now we need to clean up more of a mess. All right, I think we're just about done. I got a little distracted trying to do a selfie in front of the building, but I really love the old ruined look. And I mean, as cute as that is though, it's gonna serve everybody a lot better if it's actually a beautiful, fantastic stable for rescue horses. So there's that. Do I need to do like interior repairs? Huh, maybe up top. Let's go back up top and see what's up there. All right, aha! And here are the final repairs. <gasps> wow! This is gorgeous! To the entire stables. And there we go, guys. So, we have got all of the buildings set up. We have fixed the fencing. We have tidied up the yard. I think that the entire layout is ready to go. And now we need to see what Hugh wants to do next with this place. So next time we come back, we're going to go and visit with him and see what missions he has for us. If it has something to do with actually helping add in rescue horses to the, the entire ranch, I am going to be completely blown away and so happy. But I'm super happy about everything we've done too. Look at how gorgeous this place is now. And now it's time to fill it with horses. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.